Ever wondered why a tornado spins around like a top, or how it forms? Well, buckle up. We're about to dive into the exciting world of tornadoes. It's like a magical place where science and nature play together making something really cool and a bit scary at the same time. Imagine this, there's a party happening deep inside a big storm, and it's time for a special dance to start. This dance is super special. It's like a dance off between the wind and the elements. They spin around and around, making patterns that look like a tornado. This tornado, like its brothers and sisters, was born in the loud, booming, booming heart of a thunderstorm. But this isn't just any thunderstorm. It's a supercell thunderstorm, the biggest, baddest storm out there that's both awesome and a little bit scary. Picture the winds inside this big, mean storm. They're like a bunch of wild horses, running around and around, each gust making the storm bigger and badder. All this craziness inside the supercell creates something that's kinda scary, but also super cool. The winds inside the storm start spinning around like a merry-go-round, making a show that's out of this world. They spin and twist super fast, circling around a center point. This point, sorta like the eye in a game of I Spy, is where our tornado is born. As the spinning gets faster and faster, an invisible tube of wind starts to form, reaching down from the storm above. This invisible tube, like a sneaky ninja, isn't noticed until it touches the ground and starts picking up stuff like leaves, dust, and everything it finds, transforming into the big, swirly shape that we know as a tornado. This tornado, like all others, was born from a thunderstorm. But remember, this wasn't any old thunderstorm. It was a supercell thunderstorm, the toughest and biggest storm on Earth. The winds inside this storm start to spin and twirl, creating our tornado. You see, this tornado isn't just spinning for no reason. It might look like a giant air twister having fun, but it's much more than that. It's like a superhero of nature, super strong and super scary at the same time. What you're seeing here is like the Earth's breath twirling and whirling all at once, so it's not something to joke about. But let's slow down a bit and look at this twister closely. A tornado, or let's call it a super twister, is like a spinning straw that touches the ground and the bottom of a stormy cloud at the same time. This spinning straw isn't just playing around. It has a job to do, a mission to complete, a game to win. This mission, or game, is what makes a super twister different from a simple blow of wind. The super twister is like a detective, always on the lookout for a specific clue. It's always after warm, moist air, which it needs to dance its powerful dance. This warm and moist air works like a big piece of candy, giving the Super Twister the power it needs to keep dancing and swirling. People often say a Super Twister is like a hungry animal looking for food. As it moves over grasslands, through towns and cities, across mountains and rivers, it's always sniffing around for its favorite candy. It's like a dog sniffing out its favorite bone. And how does it get this power? By gobbling up the warm, moist air it's after. This is just like how you suck up juice through a straw. With every slurp of this warm, moist air, the Super Twister gets bigger, stronger, and faster. It's like a fun game between nature and science that's amazing to watch, showing us how wild and surprising our Earth can be. So, with every slurp of this warm, moist air, the Super Twister gets stronger and stronger and stronger, eating up the air candy to keep its powerful dance going. It keeps getting stronger and stronger with each slurp. Did you know tornadoes can spin faster than racing cars? Amazing, right? When you think of tornadoes, you may imagine them as loud and strong, but slow like a sleepy turtle. But this isn't true. Tornadoes are actually super quick and strong, just like your favorite superhero. How fast do they spin? Imagine this. A tornado can turn around and around faster than 200 miles per hour. That's difficult to imagine, right? Let's compare it with things you know. A cheetah, the fastest cat on the land, can only run as fast as 75 miles an hour. That's way slower than a tornado, isn't it? Also. Think about a racing horse. As fast and powerful as they are, they can only reach speeds of about 50 miles per hour. That's like a snail compared to our speedy tornado. And even the super fast trains that we see zooming on the tracks, they can only reach up to 150 miles per hour. So when you think about these comparisons, you can truly understand how fast and strong tornadoes are. They are like the superheroes of nature, flying faster than a racing cat, a galloping horse, and even a zooming train. Isn't that super cool? But remember, even though they're cool, they can be scary too. So it's always best to stay safe. Have you ever wondered where tornadoes love to play the most? They love to play in a place we call Tornado Alley. Think of it like a big playground filled with all sorts of weather surprises that make it the perfect place for tornadoes to put on a show. But don't let the word alley trick you. It's not like a tiny alleyway in your neighborhood. This isn't a place where you'll find kids playing catch or a cozy little cafe hidden away. 
This Tornado Alley is kind of like the biggest, most exciting roller coaster ride of weather. It's like a giant stage where nature shows us just how powerful and amazing it can be. It's a name used by weather scientists, storm chasers, and even people like you and me who just love to learn about the weather. This name is both exciting and a little scary for those who have seen these whirlwinds in action. This alley is actually a big area in the United States. Its borders are a bit fuzzy, but people generally agree that it's a long stretch all the way from the bottom in Texas to the top in South Dakota. That's like going on a road trip through lots of different places, each with its own special culture, history, and people. But they all have one thing in common. They are all part of the Tornado Alley Club. Tornadoes here aren't like rare unicorns. They come around pretty often. They're as much a part of this area as the people who live here. They're like dancers on this big weather stage, spinning and twirling and sometimes leaving a bit of a mess behind. They love to play in this playground called Tornado Alley. Remember, it's not really an alley. It's a big area in the United States where these twisters love to put on their show, stretching from Texas all the way up to South Dakota. So, you know how tornadoes can be super strong and scary, right? They're like giant spinning tops that come from really big thunderstorms and can even go as fast as a race car, up to 300 miles per hour. They can mess up homes, pull out trees, and leave everything looking like a big mess. You might have seen them as the bad guys in movies, causing all sorts of trouble. But they're not just about mess and mayhem. Tornadoes have a special job in our world that not a lot of people know about. There's more to these wild wind spinners than just causing a mess. They help to share the heat around the world, kind of like how when you share your toys with your friends, they suck up hot, wet air from places near the equator and lift it up into the cooler, drier air high above us. This helps make sure it's not too hot in one place and too cold in another, so the Earth's temperature stays just right. This is a bit like how an air cooler works. Just like the cooler takes the hot air from inside your room and throws it outside to make your room cooler, tornadoes take hot air from hot places to cooler places. They're like Earth's big air coolers. So we see that tornadoes, even though they can mess up things, are important for our world's weather. They're not just big bullies causing destruction. They're a big part of Earth's cool weather machine. So in a fun way, they're like the Earth's giant air coolers. All right, kiddos, here's a cool, easy to remember rhyme about tornadoes. In the heart of a big storm, a special dance begins. A twirling, twirling tornado, spinning, spinning like a top. Its winds go round and round, stronger than anything we can see faster and swifter than a race car zooming down a racetrack, up warm air like a giant vacuum cleaner, becoming bigger, stronger, and even more amazing with each twirl. This spinning top of nature dances the ground, moving in time with the stormy weather. It really likes a place called, called Tornado Alley, where it visits frequently to dance. Here, in this world of winds, they love to spin and twirl, just like dancers in a wind ballet. Even though they're big and powerful, tornadoes have an important job in nature. They help spread warmth from one place to another on our Earth, which is as interesting as it sounds. Tornadoes, even though they're strong and scary, aren't just bullies, they're part of a careful balance. So remember this rhyme, and you'll know the cool story of the tornado show.